Hello guys, uh, I'm Bintang Senja and in this video, I'm gonna be showing you uh, how I light a simple interior scene in Blender. Okay, so uh, this simple scene, you can grab it or download it from the link below in the description. And we'll start over, okay? The first thing that we need to do is uh, to make a lamp. Absolutely. Uh, shift A and uh, area and I grab it here and move it there and put it on top of the room okay the idea behind this is uh, to make sure that we have a light source from from the top just like on other interior so I will change the parameter to uh, because yeah you you need to see that I use metric here and we will change this one to 50 centimeter uh, for the size and uh, yeah you know because this is like uh, the, the the word unit all the model here is already uh, made uh, by measurements uh, so like in the physical world so 50 centimeters I think it's good enough for source of lights okay and another thing is I will change this color to black body to make it uh, to set up a temperature for the lights and it's it's gonna be uh, 5500 Okay, and then the strength is gonna be 30 because I think cycles is measure the the strength by watt. Okay, so I need 30 watt here. Okay, now uh, we'll start to render. And first thing first, uh, I'll change this resolution to 50 and uh, samples. I think 100 is enough for now. Okay, it's 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 okay, and uh, on the render layers, activate the denoising. Okay, okay, then leave it there. Oops, and now we ready to render. Okay, as we can see here, uh, we have a light source, uh, a simple light source. Okay, that coming from the top of the room okay this is a good starting point for us okay cool now we have a light and I will press escape and another thing that I need to change is the naming of these lights I will change it to LGT for the lights and uh, I will call it top top okay LGT top and then uh, now I will start to uh, hide the lights okay and make another light another lamp another area lights and this is gonna be our like you know uh, sometimes we have a bonus light from another room and this light is trying to make uh, a bounce light from another room okay yeah and I'll uh, change this one to two meters because it's gonna be big absolutely because we are trying to make another light source from another room so it's gonna be big and the bounces I think it's four is enough and uh, the color the color i think we can try it so blue okay and then the strength i will leave it to 100 okay now uh, i will place it like that because yeah uh, it's 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 supposed to be a little bit angled like this because uh, it's it will make sure that our light is like coming from the top also okay now uh, because LGT top it's already hidden I will make a rename for this one and call it LGT left blue and now I will test a render again okay and I will go for 15 and then 
F12 or just render render image. Okay, our room right now it's uh, looking blue, like bluish. But don't worry because we will combine all the lights uh, after this. And this is looking pretty good. Okay, and I will escape it again and then uh, hide it again and make another one. Okay, with also area lights and try to place it here. And for this, I will make a rectangle, and I think I'm gonna be uh, stick with like about 70 centimeter and then the y is gonna be 1.5 meters okay i'm sorry it's it's flipped okay it's gonna be 70 centimeter okay and then the bonds always four and it's slightly orange okay and the strength it's gonna be 50 and now oh sorry oh sorry i press seven yeah seven in the numpad should be okay now it's uh it's point towards uh, this furniture and also same like before it's like making making it angled like this one it will gonna help okay now uh light lighting left blue is already hidden and okay rename it again right hand oops right orange sorry yeah and now render it again mm, i kind of um, want to change the the color a little bit more saturated to yellow something like this maybe and then press f12 again okay i think this is good enough so uh the idea is to make sure that uh, we have a balanced light after this like the first thing that we did is uh, make one top light and then make another two that coming from the side of the room and with a complementary color like blue and orange okay now if we if we start to uh, activate or unhide the left blue and the lighting top or the LG to top uh, I think gonna go to slot 2 and press F12 again now we can see we have like a nice uh, combination between the colors itself okay so the room is looking uh, okay right now because yeah as you can see here uh, the light is uh, looking good but I just wanna change these uh, shadows here and I will make sure that I'll press uh, cancel or escape but I need to change this to like uh, maybe like something like this so the shadow is kind of um, be too oh no this one gonna be two but this one gonna be 1.5 I guess okay okay let's see okay I think this is good this is good enough okay we have such a um, balance between the lights and with the, no with the denoising how can I pronounce this denoising uh, it's uh, it making it really good it's soft and then clean and thanks for this one the denoising you are awesome okay guys and uh, the next video I'm going to talk about how to apply the texture and shaders for this simple interior 
but for right now this one is uh, our final result of the how to make sure our light is uh, balanced enough in 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 our uh, lighting okay so thank you for watching and see you in the next video